I'm Rick Steves, I'm in Guatemala, and this is a giant sugar plant. You know, the major export crop of Guatemala is sugar. And Guatemala was like the original banana republic, and that's a derogatory term for a country that lets the rich countries control it by keeping the, the price and the export conditions of their only natural resource at a disadvantaged way. But Guatemala now is working on efficiency, they're working on branding, they're working on uniform quality, they're working on uh, producing in a way that they can compete on a global scale. And corporations need to be ethical, so they have to be concerned about the conditions of their workers. They have to be concerned about environmental smartness and having green facilities. This plant brags that most of its energy is produced by burning the, uh, the uh, husk of the sugar cane. Uh, as far as these workers go, they're happy to get this work. That's pretty hard labor up there. And they're working at $3 an hour. The minimum wage in this country is $2 an hour. And on this scale, in this economy, that's considered a good, solid job. The world is a global economy. And uh, there has to be a dose of practicality and efficiency. And here in Guatemala, we're seeing how a developing country can grow beyond being a manipulated, kept down banana republic and uh, get the most mileage out of whatever natural resources it's blessed with. And in the case of Guatemala, that's a lot of sugar. Look at that mountain of sugar. There's no pallets there. That is just like sandbags of sugar. And next time you open up a sugar packet to sweeten your coffee, remember, these people up here helped make it happen. It's fun to learn from our travels. Happy travels.